Sheridan! Hey! Did you get my message? I know it was late, I but... got your message. I got it loud and clear. And now I've got a message for you, Lois, but I want you to listen carefully because I don't want you to misunderstand any of it. <sighs> what the heck? Stay what? the hell out of my life! I never want to see you again! What the heck was that for? As if you don't know. I don't. Oh, come on, Luis. I know what kind of guy you are. I know what you're after, and I've known from the beginning. What I'm after? But you picked the wrong girl. What are you talking about? I don't even want to get into it. Well, I deserve some explanation. You don't deserve anything. I, I don't want to look at you. I, I don't even want to talk to you. In fact, from now on, you stay on your side of the tracks, and I'll stay on mine, okay? W what the hell is this all about? Wait, I, I, I don't, I don't get it. What is this about? Well, it's not that I don't understand how Sheridan let herself be used in the past. I do. I understand all too well. She's so starved for love that she'll believe anything that a man tells her. I'm telling you, I got her at a point right now where she'd do anything for me. But hey, I gotta go easy. I don't want to scare her away. At least not till I get what I want from her. You know exactly what this is about. No. No, I don't. I have no idea. Tell me. Will you please tell me what it is that you think that I've done? Oh, come on, Luis. I swear I don't know. All right. I can play this little game, too. I'm not playing a game. No, no, you once said that the rich and the poor can't mix. That they don't have anything in common. That they come from two different worlds. Yeah, but I don't necessarily no, 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 think... No, 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 You were right, Luis. Because we can't mix. We are different. We don't have anything in common. And we certainly cannot fit into my life. Where the hell is this coming from? I mean, I, I don't get it. What's that to get? I mean, I certainly got it from the very beginning, what you wanted from me. What, what I wanted... F I didn't want oh, anything. You know, cut the bull, Luis. I'm used to it by now from guys like you. It's always the same. Guys like me? Now, what the hell is that supposed to mean? I'm on to you, Luis. But I want you to know it goes both ways. Because I've been using you, too. Using me? Uh-huh. You had to have known that the only thing that you could be good for for me is just a fling. Some boy toy. Someone that I could have my fun with, and then once I got tired and bored, just moved on. Well, that time has come. I'm through with you. You've had your 15 minutes of fun. Oh, and by the way, now that I have served my time here at the Youth Center, we don't ever have to see each other again. So don't try contacting me. In fact, I couldn't care less if I ever see you again. You've served your purpose. Could I have been so stupid? Luis? Luis? Teresa. I didn't hear you come in. Something wrong? I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Does it have to do with you and Sheridan? There is no me and Sheridan. Why? What happened? I don't know. Well, you, you must know, Luis. I mean, 
Did you have an argument? Look, I don't know. It's the truth. I thought we were getting along fine. You know, at least that is what I thought. And she flew in here and just laid into me. Said that she knew we were never going to last and she'd had her fun with me and she was finished with me. That's what she said? She was finished with you? Her words exactly. Oh, along with she never wanted to see me again. Ever. You're kidding. What did you do? I told you, I didn't do anything. Well, did you try to talk to her? There was no talking to her. She blew in here like a tornado and then just blew right back out. Well, you have to go after her, find out what's going on. No way. I'm not gonna crawl to her. She made it very clear that she wanted nothing to do with me. You know, I should have known that something like this was gonna happen. You know, I let myself forget the very thing that I've always warned you about. Not to get involved with the Cranes. You know, our family and the Cranes just can't mix. I can't believe Sharon would do that. Oh, yeah. She's always seemed so nice. That's the Cranes for you. They suck you in. And then they spit you out when they're through with you. Well, I'll tell you one thing. This makes me determined to make sure that you never go near that damn family and that you forget about that crazy fantasy that you have with Ethan. Don't worry, Louise. There's no chance of me ever being with Ethan. You mean that, Teresa? I do, Louise. Nothing can ever happen between Ethan and me. You know, people like the Cranes, they're different from us. They don't know about honesty. They don't know how to give real love. All they know how to give is pain. And from now on, we stick with people from our own background. People we can trust. As for people like the Cranes and their kind, well, the hell with them. The hell with them.